Viral Science, the home of creativity. This video is sponsored by Ultium 365. It's a very good PCB designing tool and Octopart which is a very good and fast search engine for electronic components. This is a mini smart switch with which you can convert your home into a smart home very easily. With this setup you can control your appliances with your smartphone and also with the manual switches and you will get the real time feedback of the switches on the smartphone. Not only this you can also use Google Assistant and Alexa to control your appliances. Turn on switch 1. Okay. Hey Google. Turn off switch 1. Sure. Turning off mini switch. Hey Google. Turn on switch 1. Okay. Turning off mini switch. Alexa. Turn off switch 1. Okay. So this is the mini palm size smart switch. It's very small and weighs around 30 grams. Inside this box you will find a user manual and the smart switch. All the connections are well labeled on the back side of this switch. And you will also find a push button on the front of this mini switch. This button can be used for pairing and to turn on and off the devices. This manual is a complete guide to set up this mini switch from circuit diagram to mobile application setup, everything. So to purchase this mini smart switch, you can visit flyrobo.in. So this is the single channel switch which I am using and links to buy this will be in the description down below. They also have two channel, four channel switches as well. So do check it out. Then you will need this 2 pin to power up this mini smart switch. Next you will need is this bulb holder. And you will also need a on off switch to manually control your appliances. Now follow this wiring diagram and make your connections and till then let's look at the sponsor of this video. Ultium 365 designer is an amazing tool with lots of features that makes PCB designing very easy and fast. You can share your PCB designs with a click to your teammate and they will receive an email with the link where they can easily view the designs using the browser and comment the reviews and corrections on the project itself. Ultium 365 is a full built package and requires no additional licenses. And with the Octopart linked with Ultium, you can get real time insights and the data of all the components. It's the fast search engine for electronic components and you can find each minute detail of the components in it. Links for the free trial Ultium Designer, Ultium 365 and Octopart is in the description below so you can check it out. So first we'll connect this bulb holder to live out and the neutral out pins of this mini smart switch. Next we'll connect is this 2 pin to live in and to the neutral in. And then we'll connect the switch to neutral in and the switch pin. So after completing the connections, you will need to download this application Smart Life Smart Living. It's available for both iOS and Android devices. So after downloading the application, turn on your Bluetooth and open the application. So here you need to sign up with your email ID. I've already did it. So now we'll power on our mini smart switch. So after powering this on, by pressing the toggle button, you can see the light turns on and off. So first we'll press and hold this button for 7 to 8 seconds to go into the pairing mode. And then you can see the blue light blinking. It means it's in the pairing mode. Then we'll click on add devices on the top of this application. 
here we'll click on add devices and here it will show all the scanned devices it will top up on the top and over here you need to enter the Wi-Fi credentials after you enter the Wi-Fi credentials it will send the credentials to this mini switch and this thing will be done so the setup is completed so by pressing the switch on the smartphone you can see the light turns on and when you again press the switch it turns off similarly you can do it manually with the manual switch as well and you can see the real time feedback on the smartphone so as you can see when i turn on the switch manually it also changes in the application as well so now we'll connect this with the google assistant so go on the top of here and over here select the google assistant and here you just need to sign in with the google id it's a very simple process just click on continue agree and link the google id and all the devices will be linked with your google assistant and now we'll do for the amazon alexa go to this amazon alexa sign in with the amazon id give the permissions and this thing is also done so now let's see this complete setup in action Alexa, turn on switch 1. Okay. Alexa, turn on switch 1. Okay. Hey Google, turn off switch 1. Alright, turning off mini switch. Hey Google, turn on switch 1. Alright, turning mini switch on. So friends if you like this video then do hit that like button share this video with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.